And we are outside Petco Park. It is a beautiful day. Of course, the stadium just letting out after a very exciting win today. Hoping for a lot more, but you know what we are going to be getting a lot more of is that rain. Unfortunately for this weekend, as we cue the ferry going by Petco Park, as we look from Kiyoe's at the Coronado Ferry Landing, temperatures in the 60s. It is a little bit cooler right now than it was at this time yesterday, and cooling is going to be the trend through Sunday. Heading into tomorrow, we'll start off with low clouds, maybe a little bit of patchy fog for the inland neighborhoods, and most areas will still clear out to mostly sunny skies. 60s for the coast and valleys, 40s in the mountains, so already cooling off in the mountains and nice in the deserts. It will be pretty gusty again tomorrow in the mountains and deserts. So we're going to see an atmospheric river roll through on Saturday, and then the center of that storm system is going to be rolling south on Sunday. So this weekend, it's pretty much a wash. The wide spread rain on Saturday is pretty much going to be steady all day. It will be heavy at times, and I think the greatest threat of flooding is going to be during the day on Saturday. So a flood watch is in effect for the coast, mountain, and inland neighborhoods from 4 a.m. Saturday. It lasts through Sunday, but Sunday is going to be more on and off rain. A winter storm watch has been issued from 3 p.m. Saturday until 6 a.m. on Monday for our mountain areas. This is above 5,000 feet, so does not include Julian, but Mount Laguna, Palomar, Lookout Mountain, we could see one to four inches of snow. Happy spring to you. All right, some gusty winds will be accompanying this storm. We're going to notice the winds. We've been noticing the winds. The winds are going to remain gusty through the day tomorrow. Mountain and deserts, we could see gusts anywhere from 30 to 50 miles per hour. On Saturday, the, remain, the winds do remain very gusty. It's a little different than the morning show. <laughs> All right, temperatures, or I mean winds rather, are going to be topping off about 35 miles per hour for the coast and inland neighborhoods. Peak gusts could reach 40. Mountains and deserts on Saturday and Sunday still very gusty. Peak gusts actually could reach 60 miles per hour. All right, let's talk about the rain. There is a chance for showers as early as 2, 3, 4 o'clock in the morning on Saturday. That is ahead of the atmospheric river. And then here it comes, and it is so slow moving. By 9 a.m., heavy, steady rainfall is impacting the North County. It's slow spread south but as you can see it continues all day this is 1 30 in the afternoon at some point in the afternoon into the evening snow levels will be dropping so we'll start off with rain in the mountains but by one two o'clock some areas are going to see that rain transition to snow above 5500 feet and then potentially as low as 4500 feet at times saturday night into sunday all right after about five six o'clock the rain turns more showery kind of more on and off that will continue through the day on Sunday, and that's also when we'll have a chance for thunderstorms. And any thunderstorms that form are going to have the ability to produce some very heavy rainfall in a short period of time. A few isolated showers continue on Monday, but Monday is not going to be as impacted as what we're going to be seeing over the weekend. Saturday is going to be the worst of it. It's also going to be colder, 50s and low 60s for highs for the coast and valley areas this weekend. Temperatures topping off 10 to nearly 20 degrees below normal. It doesn't last, though. Look at that. By Tuesday, we're already back in the 70s inland. The mountain areas, we're going to see those snow levels dropping again late Saturday into Sunday. Those snow levels will hover between about 4,500 feet to 5,500 feet through Monday and the desert areas. Accumulations here about half an inch or less. The rest of us, we were looking at about one to two inches, locally three or more inches. And it is just a nice day here today. So enjoy it while you can. One more nice day tomorrow before the rain rolls in.